Yo, what's up, y'all? This is your boy Shy Baker back with another pick up review, uh, another detail review at that. Enough talking, let's go ahead and get into a review. We've got the KD6, of course. You all know the KD box. You know, you got, you know, uh, the design on the shoe as well on the box. You got the designs right here as well. Got the orange swoosh right there. Curve around on the side of the box. Kind of almost looks like a five, but it's not. Don't quote me on that, though. Here's the box, uh, here's the physical size, the name of the shoe, and the colorway. Once it focuses in, better read this shit off to you Alright, we got a KD6, physical size of a 10, it's a 10, colorway is black, metallic, silver, teen, orange, photo, blue. Price tag at 130 you know, open the box, nothing special about the paper, there's a receipt. Didn't mean to throw the box, but oh well. <laughs> and, uh, y'all ready for this one? You sure? Fuck it, let's get it. Boom, there it is. The KD6. Away colorway, one of the best colorways in my opinion. And like I said, to each, to each his own on this shoe as well as this colorway. But this is the best colorway in my opinion because, first of all, this shoe is solid and simple. Not because it's a low top, but I think because of the tech on it. And just the overall shoe, you know, hitting y'all with a 360 review. Um... Uh, so if, if you're going to do a colorway on a shoe, do something solid and simple. That's how I am. I'm a solid and simple shoe type of guy. I, I try not to get nothing too extravagant. Then again, I try to get something that's you know, in my range. You know, something I can see myself rocking. But uh, this is the best colorway in my opinion. I'm waiting on the way. I'm in a home colorway. And, was, the, and I might do an ID, but don't quote me on that ID. And a, a home colorway will be the only ones I pick up unless they just do something crazy. As far as all the other colorways that are dropping, I'm not really feeling the bamboos. Hell no nah, on them PB and Jane. Them scamps was ugly. Horrible design, Nike, and horrible. They didn't they just didn't put that together where you asked me. Too much yellow on that one. And uh I ain't gonna bash y'all Nike because hell y'all see the posters on my wall. Y'all see Kobe. I'm a hell of a support a supporter of y'all, what y'all doing in y'all shoe game, y'all sneakers and whatnot. But enough talking, let's go ahead and get into the review. Detail review with that. So expect it run a little long, so sit back, relax, and enjoy. Cause I'm giving it to y'all. <laughs> All right, you got a, a storytelling soul, and the whole theme on this is time precision. They do got that colorway coming, so stay tuned for that one as well. Not from me, but I'm just saying the colorway's going to drop. Uh, as you can see, if you look behind the photo blue and team orange, you can see what I mean when I say this shoe. The sole of the shoe is based on like a watch, one of KD's favorite watches. It still got the... Uh, the storytelling soul at the top, too, as well. You see these right here. That was on the five. They're a little different. But you can also see that that watch theme, you know, behind it if you look real close. See it? Kind of behind it. Coming on down, you got more of that Team Orange photo blue. You got that uh, KD uh, hologram logo, which is pretty dope in my opinion. See how it changes colors. Uh, front of the shoe, you got Seat Mount Pleasant's Finest. Once they focus in, Seat Mount Ple Pleasant's Finest. All right. Uh, you got a predominant black shoe with, like I say, hints of team orange, photo blue, even some photo blue speckles in the midsole. So, so let's get to it. Uh, starting out with the, uh, we already started the sole. So coming to the air unit, you got a cream orange like air unit. It's not as dark as the, the, uh, the orange right here. It's more like a cream, you ask me. Cream orange, which is pretty tight to me. Uh, you got the photo, photo blue on the midsole with the, uh, the lighter photo, photo blue speckles. I'll let you get a peep of that. You got this theme right here that's on the shoe as well. That's throughout the shoe. We'll get to that a little later. Uh, you got a Nike Zoom and Wording right here on the midsole. And Photo Blue with the speckle on it. You got that Team Orange right there. Like I said, Seat Mount Pleasant Finest on the front. Uh, you got that silver swoosh. In my opinion, I thought they should have threw the orange or blue, but once I got it in person, seen this in person on feet, you know, I was like, you know what? That right there stands out. Like I said, you got a metallic silver swoosh or silver, whatever you want to call it. Get the focus in. You got that fly wire behind it and it's not exposed, which is dope in my opinion for not exposing it. Uh, let's get the people of those fly wire cables. You got the uh, the photo blue KD logo with those waves like on it too. 
Like I said, that theme on the midsole is on her as well. So like I said, it's, it's throughout the shoe. Uh, curving around in front of the toe box, you got more of that uh, hyperfuse, hyperfuse technology. You got photo blue on, on, on the outside of the tongue. You got those, that team orange laces with more of that photo blue behind this. And you got hyperfuse behind the tongue as well, right there. Coming up to the top of this funky looking tongue, which is dope in my opinion. You got that photo photo blue tongue right here. And if you're looking right here, everybody's like, man, what's the deal on this logo? And let me point out, let me let me point out some things on this logo. You already know it makes a six and a three and a five. And if you don't know how it makes a six and a three and a five, do your little homework on it and just look at it. I'm gonna point it out to you guys though. Once it focus in. All right, you look that way, you see the six, which is quite obvious. Turn it this way, and once it focus in again, you'll see the five, boom, 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 and boom. And if you turn it this way, you'll see the three, boom, boom. There it is, six, three, five. The six is more obvious than anything because of it, it because the logo it stands up here. Six three five. There's nothing behind it. Like I said, split tongue. Let you get a peep of that also. Try to get a little bit more split. Split tongue inside of the shoe. Got the KD Sig. Orange footbed. Photo blue logo. Got the physical size. Size 10. UPC number. Let you get a peep of that too. Got the production date as well. Uh, back of the shoe, well, opposite side of the shoe, got more of that photo blue with that uh, silver or metallic silver swoosh with more of that wave-like design on it. And once it focuses in, you'll see what I mean. There it is. Yep, photo blue mist on, on this side as well with the lighter photo blue speckles on it, which is dope in my opinion also. Once it focuses in, you get the people of it. I'm on focus in. Okay, don't want to focus. You got an orange, uh, like a cream orange uh, air bubble running around this side as well. You got the, uh, the lightning blue split at the back, you know, that splits off the contrast blue, black, and I guess metallic silver on this side as well. And um, as you can see, you see the logo right here. I meant the uh, theme right here or the design right there, but you can also see it right there too, which is dope. Uh, other than that, the lace loops are orange or the lace holes, which is hyperfuse cables or fly wire cables. Orange on this side as well. Uh, jump to the other shoe. Like I said, there's really nothing a lot of tech to this shoe, you know, besides, you know, the hyperfuse, the uh the hyperfuse cables, you know, you know, the air unit that is placed right off in this area. Air unit, and they're right there. This is a silent and simple shoe. That's why I said the colorways that they're doing on these is is it's iffy in my opinion because like I said, I'm a silent and simple guy. I try to just pick up some solid shit. I don't try to do too much. I'm not saying the colors, I mean the Texans was tight though. The uh, the bamboos bamboos was dope. The DC preheats that was a little too much for me, and I'm damn sure I'm not talking about the price. Uh, and uh, the weatherman's those those was okay. I just wasn't feeling that colorway. It was too much black for me. But like I said, I'm not bashing y'all. Solid and simple is what I do. Like I said, to each his own. Everybody got their own opinion. I'm a voice mine. You got that uh, hyperfuse uh, non-exposed cable right here behind. Behind this silver swoosh underneath this uh hyperfuse tech. Once it focus in, I'll get a peep of that. Let you get a peep of that. More that that like wavy light design on this metallic silver swoosh. Uh orange sock liner, orange footbed, photo blue, KD logo. Or KD Sig, sorry about that. More that metallic silver on this side. More that hyperfuse right here. Which is dope. Those, there, that's that uh, hyperfuse cable I was telling you about that was orange. Uh, seat Mount Pleasant's finest. And I forgot to point out his boy, Big Chucky.
Big Chucky. Orange mist, uh, orange air unit. And uh, that right there about wraps up this video, man. Like I said, solid and simple colorway. One of the best colorways, in my opinion. Like I said, to each his own on this color. You know, looking for the home colorways for these to drop, and I'm pretty sure they're gonna have a, a, a quick strike release this month. So hopefully they drop this month. But I ain't gonna hold y'all up no more. Appreciate y'all time and effort. Thanks for watching this video. Stay tuned for more. Follow me on Instagram and Twitter, and make sure y'all subscribe to my channel. I'm out. Peace.